told them, please don't shoot us. We didn't do nothing. We didn't harm nobody. And the one of the members looking into my eyes and said, it's Bachel Yehud, like, kill all the Jews. I'm here at Kibbutz Be'eri, in the south of Israel. Kibbutz Be'eri is the kibbutz that suffered the most amount of losses and the most devastation at the massacre of October 7th. I'm here with Mili. She's one of the survivors. And we are here to bear witness. That's your house? Yes. Oh my God. I can't even enter my house to see if there is something remained because yeah. all the center of the house is crushed. They told us there are terrorists in, uh, in the kibbutz. We start to get messages. Listen, someone shot my mom, someone shot my dad. There is a lot of blood here. Please, the terrorists come inside my house. We were here in the safe room. The, me, my husband and my three kids. 15, 14, and 9 years old. They uh, throw some kind of a hand grenade at the door, but it wasn't open. When we understand that, oh, we're gonna be burned alive or, uh, or die from the, the smoke inhaling, we decided uh, to jump. Jump from the second floor? From the second floor. To here? Yeah. On October 7, eight of my family members were here. Two, my aunt and my uncle live in a house that's 200 meters from here, they were murdered in their house. Burned the house and they fired at them and then they brought a digger. In that room there were a three-year-old girl, an eight-year-old boy, a 12-year-old girl, and the adults, all of them civilians. And when they opened the windows, they were afraid they'll start throwing grenades in, so they gave up. There were no members of Barry. There were only terrorists running around the two paths to the road. They were standing there, black car. They got inside uh, Yossi, Ophir, and Amit. Only the boys. My, my daughter said to her boyfriend, Listen, Ophir, I love you. Please come back. And they drove away. My son, he broke his leg, his foot, while we were jumping. We went to their uh, safe room up there, and uh, we stayed there until uh, the rescue at uh, 7 uh, p.m. And they brought us, you know, the soldiers from here, there, and they told us, Close your eyes, everybody. And all the children were like, covering their eyes, their moms and their dads. All around here in the road, they were covering a lot of bodies. And they took all of them, except my father. They killed my father. It's not real to me yet. No. I come to this house and it's completely destroyed and it's not real to me yet. Standing here at Berry under a house that was burned down in the ashes, in the destruction, it's just a reminder that I'm Israel Chai. I'm Israel Chai.